We are joined now by our zoological manager, Liz Anderson, and Aileen Van Pelt, media relations and development manager, both from the Palm Beach Zoo, and they've brought along Franny. Tell us about Franny. That's right. Franny is a gopher tortoise. This is actually the state Florida, a state tortoise of Florida. <laughs> um, and they get their name because they dig really deep burrows in the ground. And uh, those burrows are important not only for gopher tortoises, but for other species in the ecosystem because they use those burrows for protection. Um, so if the gopher tortoise were to disappear, that would definitely affect the populations of other animals and ecosystem. Now I know these guys also, I've seen them you know, try to cross roadways, that kind of thing. It's probably a danger for them. Should people stop and help or call somebody? Um, well, gopher tortoises are protected, um, so people definitely want to try and leave them alone as much as possible. Um, I would break for gopher tortoises if I were you. Um, <laughs> but the, uh, the thing is, if they're in your yard, you definitely want to stay within 25, 25 feet away. Um, if you're going to be disturbing their burrows, you actually need a special permit. Um, but we want to save habitat for them because when we relocate them, it can actually cause more problems for their population because of the spread of disease and other factors. So. Definitely try and leave them alone as much as possible. Now we sometimes hear that uh, turtles, tortoises, that they could live a long time. How old is Franny? Franny is about 13. They can live to be over 40. Um, but we have some tortoises at the zoo that can live to be over 100 or even wow. over 150 years. Aww. So that's one of the reasons why we have Franny here today is to talk about our Aldabra tortoise encounter that's coming up. Yeah, well, tell us about that because our, our viewing audience, you can all really get a, a, a close and personal experience. Oh, yes, and we're not talking, we're talking about the Aldabra tortoises wow. that are hundreds of pounds and, you know, <laughs> are 50, 80, 100 years old. And we've just started this. And so um, you get to come out, visit with them, learn about them. You get to pet them and feed them breakfast. It is an amazing experience. It's our first interactive animal experience at the Palm Beach Zoo. Wow. And so it's available right now. You can go to our website, palmbeachzoo.org and sign up. And it's at 1030s, Wednesdays through Saturdays. And the cost is $60 for one to four people and then $90 for five to eight people. What a cool so experience. It's a great yeah. experience. And we have professional photos that are taken that you can purchase. So it's so much fun to capture that. Definitely. And then we have one other really great event. It's an, also another first time ever at the Palm Beach Zoo. It's our brew at the zoo. So for any beer connoisseurs out there, <laughs> it's April 27th from 6 to 9. You'll get to taste over 50 craft brews from 20 breweries across the state. We also have local food vendors, um, and for VIPs, you'll get premium samplings and free food. So that one's um, tickets are in advance only. So it's 35 for general admission, 75 for VIP. And zoos across the country hold this sort of thing. I don't know if you guys have been to any other zoos, but it's a great event. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it is great. They do happen across the country, but so fun that it's now in our own backyard. It is, yeah. Ales among the animals or brews with the beasts, yeah. however you want to think about it. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> well, thank you for bringing in Franny. She's really something. I like she her. Is she cute. is cute. Love yeah, I'm glad so. I Florida tortoise. Yeah, go in there. <laughs> you guys should come out and try out our Aldabra experience and be around that. Yeah, the huge, huge one. 450 quickly, pounds. How much does this one weigh? This one weighs about 20 pounds. Okay. <laughs> so, and our biggest, our biggest tortoise weighs 450. So. Whoa! <laughs> yeah. All right, then that's some good perspective. Well, thank you so much. And of course, we will be right back after this.